I think the Manic stand is brilliant. We, uh, we've had lots of great feedback from vi visitors who um, really like the idea that you've come up with, with the tree planting. The, that was the, the theme for the first day of the event was sustainability. Seeing what you're doing here is, is really clever and it, 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 it's been very well received. It's great to be here in Construction Week again uh, after a break of two years. Uh, it's wonderful to see people out and about again and uh, it's great to be able to bring the sustainability message to the Construction Week for Manic under its new brand. Everybody that comes and plants a tree with their name on enters into the competition. They get a photo taken of their name on one of the trees. At the end of the show, uh, we'll pick a winner to win a, a luxury break in a bubble dome uh, under the beautiful Fermanagh stars. Uh, they'll get to do uh, uh, water taxis, the boatyard gin tour, they'll get to do a food tour, and if they're really energetic, they'll be able to do the stairway to heaven. One of the main things uh, that we're doing to protect the planet is to use alternative fuels in our processes to help decarbonize the business. So what we're doing is we're adapting our plants and our processes to enable us to use a greater quantity of alternative fuels to lower our emissions. We have HGV trucks on the road delivering. One of the things that we do to uh, optimize that and reduce emissions is we have mixed loading. So we will mix cement products with also our insulation board so there's no empty space. And that also significantly reduces our emissions and it helps with efficiency, and so that helps everybody. I, I really enjoyed planting a tree actually remotely. It's much drier, I think, than for the people actually planting a tree. And also Scotch pine, I love that tree. It's a beautiful, beautiful you know, specimen, so a species, so it's really nice to be involved in that. I think it's sort of testament to the kind of the shifting focus of the whole construction industry that, that more and more people are understanding the role that climate and environment is going to play and therefore actually rising to the challenge. Now, you know, some of these steps are big and some of them are small, but the point is we're all beginning to understand it. It is not like a fringe item anymore. It is front and center and mainstream, and that has to be celebrated. We still all have a long way to go, but we are definitely starting to move in the right direction. And Manica are certainly trying to kind of get to grips with that, with that reality. We just launched our uh, Natural Assets Action Plan and that has been very well received locally and, in, and by our customers across the UK. It has been very exciting to be part of that development uh, in conjunction with Ulster Wildlife who have guided and directed us in terms of the various correct way to approach the whole biodiversity and carbon capture space. On the people side, uh, I think we can be quite proud of what we've achieved over the last number of years. We have a number of very successful schools programs where we get involved with secondary uh, and grammar schools in Northern Ireland uh, and we are uh, educating or helping to educate the kids in the whole space of both construction, engineering and more recently in the sustainability space. Uh, that's a very important factor for us given where we are in the community we need to have a strong supply of people coming through who are interested in our business, who are keen to develop career paths in our business. We have a continuing training and development program for lifelong learning for the people in the business. We're very keen that that has extended and grown in the years ahead.